G'day everybody, it's me again. Uh, out of all the bits I had lying around from other projects, pulled apart a couple of old boards. And there's one of them there. Pulled some components off that. Bought a couple of new triple fives and some other bits and pieces. And I built a Junior Torre once uh, for triple five for audio modulated flyback driver. Now, he did recommend a much larger MOSFET for this. He said to use an IRFP250. But I've just used an IRF540 and it's not dying. I don't run it very long. It does get very hot very quickly. Uh, I'd say like probably one minute run time at the most. Um, but for all you guys that are having trouble with ZVS drivers, um, look at this monstrosity here. That's all there. Uh, well, that voltage reg's there to keep the triple five happy because it gets about 14 volts off this. It's a lighting transformer, which I've rectified and then uh, 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 filter cap um, still gets a little bit of 50 hertz through nothing, nothing that you can really worry about uh, anyway that's just a little flyback from a TV, a modern TV it's only very small, little flybacks need love too um, yeah you don't need to use big one, uh, 5 watt resistors like that, I just did because I had them lying around, 1 watt sorry um, yeah basically that's it, just triple 5 in there or wired in, that's the audio input cap um, I've got nothing connected at the moment, and uh, that's the timing capacitor for the triple five. And uh, there's my little spark gap there, so we'll just turn this on. It's probably going to upset things. There we go, triple five flyback driver. You can still hear that little bit of, little bit of uh, what would you call it, uh, the uh, 50 hertz coming through a little bit there. Um, so yeah, the next step is to audio modulate it. What I was trying to say before is, is that uh, if you guys think ZVS circuits are complicated, um, they're really not, fellas. Um, this here is so much more complicated than a triple uh, than a uh, ZVS component count wise and uh, build wise. Yeah, ZVS is a lot easier, fellas. But this does work. Mm, didn't get too hot that run. I might try some thermal grease on that. That might help a bit. More arcs here, I like arcs. So yeah. This is a really, really relatively cheap, considering it's an IRF540 MOSFET. They're pretty cheap. They're only about you know, four dollars fifty if you pay uh, full price at JCAR. I think I get it for about three seventy with my discount card. But I've got plenty of them from uh, other little power regulator circuits I've been playing with, so... Anyway, there we go. Um, it's only eight turns on that way, um, on that uh, primary by the way. And it doesn't get any heat in the primary. Only the transistor heats. The regulator's happy. Triple five is happy. Hmm. Okay, that's it for this one. The next video I'll post of this circuit uh, is uh, with the auto mo audio modulation working. Make sure I talk properly. And uh, if you want to see a, a circuit diagram for this, I'll put a Junior Torre One's channel in the link. And uh, he actually has schematics for all of the circuits he builds on uh, on the videos themselves. So there we are. Thanks for watching, guys. Triple uh, Five Flyback Driver.